Have you ever heard of the mysterious panther clipper in a leak based video or a reddit post? Today we'll be taking a look at what the panther clipper is and everything we know about it. The panther clipper became relevant from a leak a couple years ago from some guy data mining files for Elite Dangerous Odyssey, and the clipper was one of the data mined files. People speculated that it would be a new ship for Odyssey, as there were assets for it, a description, and one commander even managed to hack into the game and make it possible to fly. People were pretty excited that this would be a new ship, but unfortunately it never got added and its ultimate fate is unknown. Currently, there seems to be no plan or speculated theories suggesting the addition of the ship. Because Elite has a good history of bringing back ships from older games, the Panther Clipper is one of them. The Clipper's history dates back to the days of Frontier Elite 2 back in the 90s as I believe. The Panther Clipper was a massive but slow ship that could quote quote buy entire planets out of the cargo. It was so big that it could equip weapons capable of planetary bombardment from orbit and was essentially immune to weapons of all small pirates. It seemed to be a capital ship slash individual ship hybrid and was a literal flying fortress. This can add a bit of context to what the ship will look like in the game itself, but we should focus on the data mine version which was either scrapped or will be added later. In Elite Dangerous, the Panther Clipper is not itself but the data mine version is called the Panther Clipper LX instead of just Panther Clipper. This is definitely because the original Clipper was way too big to fit into the landing pad, so they modified the shape to fit the landing pad and added the LX to say that it's a variant. It is allegedly produced by Zorgan Peterson and is the largest ship an individual pilot can fly. From data mine files in Elite Dangerous Odyssey, the description seems to be Close quote. The Panther Clipper LX is one of the largest ships likely to be owned by a private individual. It is also the largest ship that will fit in the internal docking bays of space stations. Piloting one requires real skill. Its cargo carrying capacity is massive, although like most other transport ships, it is lightly armed and poorly armored. As you can see, the LX variant is a slightly downgraded version of the Clipper as it has less weapons and defenses basically a huge Type 9, but it's very slow and lightly armored. Personally, I believe in Elite, it can be a pretty interesting ship with a massive cargo capacity which might surpass the thousands, but has a very slow speed and agility which is very prone to ganking and can be very inefficient to handle at times. It might be a ship with a little bit of risk with a huge reward and can be a challenge for players to fly. Perhaps it'll be a ship that will basically be only possible to traverse in supercruise using escort squadrons with a huge profitability to it, or it might be just another upgraded Type 9. Other than that, this is really the only thing I can give information about. Many different renderings and concepts are out there, but I just gave the general information that is obviously confirmed for you. If you found this helpful, please like and subscribe, 07 Commanders. And by the way, I don't think we'll be getting the Clipper anytime soon.